So glad to be able to call you my best friend. Got my senior letters, hashtag cried, but it's okay. We'll okay. be leaving here and heading to St. Louis in an hour. And Allie, this is for you. This is clip one. That way you know it's in chronological order. How are you feeling, Alexis? I'm because I'm sick. A few moments later. All right, we just got to St. Louis. We're spending the night at the classic Holiday Inn. Uh, right now, we just got a carry-on backpack. Are you on my period? <laughs> <laughs> um, right now, we're walking into the Holiday Inn. We're gonna go eat dinner, and then we're gonna be sent to our rooms and go to bed. And then we have a 5 a.m. wake-up call. Here's the room. We're only in St. Louis for one night and our wake up call is five in the morning. And then we have to eat at 5.30. And then we're off for Indy. Open it, open it. Good morning. It's currently 4.39 a.m. We have to be downstairs in the dining room at 5.30 and then we leave and finish our trip to Indy. Go team. <laughs> Um, let's see. The, the exit's right here. <laughs> Alright, we have about an hour until we arrive at Indy. Um, I just slept for like a good three hours. Um, we're about to eat lunch right now, and then we're gonna make it to Indy, and then we're gonna tour Lucas Oil Studio. Oh shoot, okay. We just got to the Lucas Oil Stadium. We're about to go tour and probably watch bands. Would you like to I need, um I really have to go to the bathroom and Davis is in front of me so really fast enough and I really just want to cry. A bunch of people came up to us and they were excited that we were from Broken Arrow and it's good to know that people are rooting for us. We just got done with the rehearsal. I just fell over. She <laughs> rapped. I, hold on, put it on me. I took the escalator and went faster. <laughs> um, right now we're getting into our hotel rooms. Then we have to go back down and get our luggage. And then we have to get ready for a buka. Rustic Italian. Yes. In a modern setting. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's a really long walk. And I'm not here for it. All right. This is the fit for Buka. Can't really see it, but we're getting ready to leave. Grand's taking a little bit longer, but that's okay. Here's the fit. She cute. I think I might be gay. Listen, I think I might be gay too. <laughs> Miss girl over here <laughs> is vlogging me. I made it into me. <laughs> That's all I wanted. <laughs> it's okay. Um, there's a little bit of a detour we have to take to Buka, but it's okay. And girls are in heels. I don't know. Miss girl is in heels, so it is quite chilly. Also. It's okay. <laughs> We just finished our buka dinner. It's about like 9.30 right now. 
Um, we're gonna go back to our hotel and settle in for the night and get ready for prelims in the morning. Good morning, it's been a minute. Um, so it's currently 4.30 in the morning. I just did my makeup. Our call time to go downstairs is 5 a.m. Um, everyone else is getting ready. All right, here's the hair, here's the uniform. I have my uh, pants on because we have to wear our suit downstairs. Um, wish us luck. We're getting ready to perform right now. Wish us luck. I'll update y'all when we finish prelims. We just got done with our prelims run. It was so good, honestly. One of my best friends. What? <laughs> okay. How are we feeling, Alexis? Feel great. Kind of chilly. But fine. Kind of chilly. Take a haul. How are we feeling? Uh, better now that I sat down for a while, but still like very tired. If you put me on any flat surface for more than 10 seconds, <laughs> I'm going down. I'm just like... Okay. So... <laughs> nightmare right now because a lot of the uh, underclassmen like aren't really paying attention and listening and the chaperones are kind of getting a little snappy at us but oh, um, getting sick and the room was hot the room was like eight degrees yeah a lot of people are getting sick um our room was 80 degrees fahrenheit and it's at 75 right that's the best it's gonna get so um Right now we're just chilling in our room. Um, we eat dinner in about an hour, so right now I think a lot of people are just trying to like hydrate and rest before we have practice at seven. Um, but yeah, I had a really fun time watching bands. I laughed and cried at the same time because of university high school. If one of if one of the band members sees this, like. Okay, so we just came down here for dinner, and uh, no one's here. They changed the dinner time, and uh, no one was here. So we got here really early, and now we're going back up to our room, because technically we haven't been dismissed yet, so. Go team. Okay, we just finished dinner. It was... 10 out of 10. Yeah, it was really good actually. We had waitresses, which I don't know, it was really unexpected. Now we're getting ready for evening rehearsal. We still have like 30 minutes good before it happens. Check. Good check. I think I'm gonna fall asleep in this hallway. And hopefully don't get woken up. Maybe there's something in there though. We do have competition. I am nervous about the general effect. Oh my god, guys, we just got visual and general effects. Caption, because I really want us to get it, but we'll see. Here's the practice room we're practicing. It's full concrete. It's really loud. We just finished rehearsal. Davidson, you want to go? <laughs> How you feeling? Like I just finished my last one. Oh. So David says, but the itinerary says we have another one tomorrow. Yeah. To be determined. So let's hope this is our last rehearsal. 
I am praying. I am praying. <laughs> so right now we're just leaving and then we're gonna head to the door. Is that Bailey? Oh. <laughs> we're gonna head back to our room and uh, go to bed and then wake up tomorrow. Lydia! How are we feeling? How are you feeling? Sad. It's our Sad. Last day. So David says. It might not be, but yeah. like having Norn come back. Oh my god, yes, Norn came back. And it was just strange, like. It was very strange. Seeing her again after four years and like getting that final pep talk from her. I know. If only she would have said comments, concerns, <laughs> that would have made it. It would have made it. But oh. I did, she made me. I, I'm just very emotional right now. <laughs> Wait, get my fit. Get my fit. This is your fit. <laughs> We're walking over to the mall right now to get food. Hopefully it doesn't take this long, but uh, this time. Wow, my words are hard. Um, yeah, very tired. Um, Lydia's vlogging behind me because she's a copycat. But anyways. <laughs> There's like another convention going on in the same at the same time. They're like a bunch of little cheerleaders. Yeah, <laughs> so cute. <laughs> It's only semis, not saying that we're gonna win finals, but we are going down tonight. We are going down. Oh my god, I'm so happy. All right. Update. It's been a minute, but we did it. We just got first place at Grand Nationals, and we set a new record of 98.2. Beat that. And my medals. Beat that. It's currently 2.30 in the morning and I'm very upset that I'm still awake. Still haven't eaten our pizza. Brooke is so angry. I don't know why. Like, come on now. 2.30 in the morning. I'm so moody. No, I think you will stay up like this every day for school. <laughs> and my medals, they're like hitting my stomach and it's making my abs twitch. So. Uh, but we did it! Ah. You didn't answer my phone call, so I wanted to make this for when you get home or when you get back to your hotel. I am so proud of you. <laughs> you accomplished something that I could never do. And. All those years paid off. <laughs> You're so good at what you do when you really show it. <laughs> I just don't remember when me and were talking you into going into Pride. And you were hesitant about it because you love soccer. <laughs> and then as soon as you got in the band room. You nailed it. You were made to do this. And I'm so glad to be able to call you my best friend. 
and I'm so proud of you. <laughs> you work so hard. Now please come home to me because I miss you. <laughs> Bye. Love you, Brooklyn. <laughs> that you're performing. Um. <laughs> so, um, now that I'm done crying and uh, being emotional about how great you are, I just wanted to tell you we finally kicked Carmel's ass. <laughs> you did it, Brooky. You kicked Carmel's ass. You. Do you remember in 2018 when I said that we called? We were in fourth place. And we just all started bawling, crying on the floor, and our eyelashes and our makeup was falling off. You did it, Brookie. You proved all of us wrong. <laughs> I'm so proud of you. Alright. We did it. I'm still processing that we just won Grand Nationals and that I have a Grand National Championship. But it's okay. I'm on the bus right now. Um, and I'm probably gonna sleep for like a good six hours.